All right, here we are. A whole day has passed. You know, I have just been sitting here with pass, you know, twiddling my thumbs. That's what I do. And maybe, maybe all that waiting was for nothing. Maybe, maybe the boss is here. Oh wow, look at this. This is really trippy. Can we go down? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> we cannot go down. Well, you know, I, I had to try. I had to try. And yeah, I have to say, like, I really love how they buffed up, you know, the Toad Flash from Mega Man 4. Like, it was a good weapon in that game, but here, you know, I think it deals... Oh, right, um, it blows me to the right there. In this game, it deals less damage, but it hits much more frequently. So, you know, ultimately, it deals more damage than before, and, you know... Yeah, it's so much more fun to use in Mega Man Maker than in the original game. Like, in the original game I used it quite a bit too, in certain rooms, especially in the wild stages. Um, you know, against those enemies that roll around and, you know, basically they curl up into a ball and became, you know, immune to shots. And the Toad Flush was very powerful against those guys, and that's how I handled them. And, whoops, that was <laughs> unfortunate. Um, okay, so... I just jumped there and I have the rain flash on, you know, in advance, basically, is what I'm trying to say. Okay, so, up here, don't use the rush or flush <laughs> yet. Also, we need to bait. Is and now, nice! Oh, okay, you know what, that is not gonna cut it. We need to do something here. Oh, wow, dude, this is really cool. <laughs> wow, okay, I was a little bit nervous about that. <laughs> How the... Oh! <laughs> I got all quiet there. Oh man. Oh wow, dude, I really hope I don't become like screwed over energy wise here. That would really be. <laughs> yeah, that would be get a little bit annoying. But. Yeah, hopefully. Hopefully, I don't ultimately need the rain flash to clear this. There seems like there are more than one path to walk here. Like, you can just go down here, I think. Yeah, you know. And that was not smart. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So let's just toad flash here again. And you know what? I'll gain some energy here. I'll be back in a sec. Okay. So now we're full on rain flush. So let's just get back into it. Yeah. And. We bait this dude, or gal, or whatever. Doesn't matter, just die. Mm. Wow. Mm. Oh, oh, I thought I was dead. No! Oh my god! <laughs> that was so funny! I was one tile away from the freaking one up. <laughs> oh. Arrgh. That was kind of unlucky. Oh, look at that! The best weapon is on ammo too. Okay, that's good to know. That's good to know. Uh... What? Okay then. That was new. <laughs> oh no. Oh! The rain flush kills the spike guys! That is super useful. Okay, the rain flash does not stay if I do that. Mm. Okay, yeah, so this is what we do. There, we just need to go. Yeah, okay, and now I have to remember to switch back here. 
Oh my god. <laughs> oh, what the hell? Oh. Okay, well. Let's just. Well, wait, here, just. Yeah, we only need to use the rain flash. Switch back. Jump, jump again. Be ready, fall behind the octopi. And drop down. And um, there we go. Okay, so yeah, it's not that bad. Now that I know what I'm doing, this is gonna be much faster in the future. And holy moly, I die there again. Uh, okay, okay, okay. How the hell did I clear it so easily the first time? I have no clue. I just... I just did it, you know. <laughs> just freaking did it. And... Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, indeed. Oh. <laughs> I constantly keep trying to jump up there, but, you know, rain just pushes, pushes me back. Is that even a word? Pushes. I don't know. Alright. Let's try and focus here. Okay, now. Nope, that won't work. Okay. Geez. Okay, so. Uh, I will grind some energy again, so I'll be back in a sec. Alright. We are back. Yeah, hopefully I don't have to <laughs> do the grind there too much more. <laughs> um, no! Okay, switch. Switch, switch, switch. We can say this. We can say this. Nice. Okay. Yeah, like, this here isn't all that hard. This is pretty easy, I would say. It's just down here. Like, what the heck do I do here? There. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. I made it. Okay. Okay, focus. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, Grace. <laughs> thank you for having mercy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was pretty difficult. Alright, okay. Right. Oh wow, dude, this is psych. Was this the right word? Psychedelic? <laughs> I'm tripping, yo. <laughs> oh, oh, look at that! I just lucked out there, kind of. Whee. <laughs> yeah, let's just get that for cushion, you know? For some cushion. Oh, wow. That's one deadly aquarium out there. And we have the boss room, okay. So we need to use this. <gasps> Oi! <sighs> and go up here, I think. And I still have not found out... Oh, here is where we use the keys. Oh, that's kind of neat. You get the trident. To defeat Bubble Man there. Okay, that's pretty cool. Okay, so that is no damage. That makes sense, you know, because he's water and all. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'll just kill him like this. If I even can kill him. <laughs> if I even can. Okay, you know what? Actually. Like, I have been starting to, you know, breaking my rule, you know, by killing bosses, you know, um, by only using the, you know, one damage item there. Uh, I have started to really been resorting to using their weakness and, yeah, I don't know. I probably should not do it too much because it dulls your senses, you know, <laughs> relying on, on the weakness. Dude, what is going on here? <laughs> I'm getting hit to the left and to the right. Okay, this is not good. 
Uh. Oh my goodness. Oh my good. I'm, I'm getting my ass kicked by Bubble Man. <laughs> I mean, I know his pattern pretty well in a standard boss arena, but this isn't too far off from a standard boss arena, which. Yeah. Oh my goodness. That was close, to say the least. Oh my god, look! Snipe me. And yeah, I'm aware that I I'm aware that I can use the, you know. Um or toad rain, toad flush, you know, whatever. Oh, oh man, I thought I could do something cool there. Alright, you know what? <laughs> I'm just going to use this. Okay. May my senses dull. Dang it! Yeah, I'm too close. That's what's going on there. You need to be further away. Yeah, look at that. I'm just being stupid, you know. And yeah. Oh, my goodness. oh dude, this was not a pretty boss. <laughs> I played him so badly. I can't do better than that. I definitely can, but yeah, I did not. Yeah, that was not a pretty boss. So I just screwed it up. <laughs> but it's kind of neat having the. Okay, so I guess I'll be the first up out there. I thought it was a fine stage. Uh, a fun one too, with lots of interesting puzzles there. But yeah, um, what was I saying? Um, yeah, it, it was a nice thing having, you know, the boss weakness inside of the boss room there, yeah. Um, having the laser trident door. What's it? What is it called? Not the laser trident. Um, the trident is, I guess. <laughs> it's a very powerful weapon and very a lot of fun to use to, you know, piercing armor and deals good damage. Yeah, yeah really strong weapon. Oh yeah, and, um, what was I going to say? Yeah, we had that. Uh, yeah, we had all those different, you know, thunderclaw segments. You know, they started out kind of hard, uh, and they got even harder towards the end. So it was nice to see a difficulty curve. We had the lift, where you know you could branch out and get additional weapons. You know, we got the rain flash, and we got the you know the standard lemon shooter, or you know the bass buster, <laughs> the bass buster. Um, unfortunately. I missed a few keys, like, the thing is, you only needed four there in the end, and I had three, and there were definitely, I wanna say there were more than three keys, or I mean four keys on the map, I feel like there were, like, five or six in total, yeah, so you don't have to necessarily get them all, which is also interesting, you know, you can miss a few of them, but, you know, don't miss too many, basically. But yeah, like, my, I think that the stage has some really cool setups, and, you know, it's fun to play through, but I fear that... For the common user or you know for yeah basically <laughs> for the, for the casual audience it is probably too hard and i think that they just did not i think they could see that the stage had you know a lot of work put into it but they probably did not vote because uh, i guess you know i might just I might just be completely wrong, but you know, I, I think that they just uh, refrained from voting because they thought it was a little bit too harder. Um, it, it does start out pretty difficult, even though it is, you know, crafty in how you build up, you know, all the puzzles with, yeah, with all different kind of gimmick items, you know. You had that one section with the Mega Man 9, you know, or is it Mega Man 10? Um, you know, the Magma Beam going across the screen and you had the time it there, that was nice. The timed uh, flying bombs puzzle there was pretty tricky as well, but it was a nice setup there. And yeah, I mean, uh, it had a lot of uh, different things going on. Uh, rain, you know, changed up pace and, you know, you had the water gimmick there towards the end as well. So a lot of difference, you know, throughout the stage. Like if I were to compare this to, um, what was it called? The previous um the previous stage that i did by count grace the hard light fortress yeah that's right the hard light fortress um i would definitely say that this is a step in the right direction towards making a great stage you know it it was you know the layout of the whole stage is a lot better i, I mean from an objective standpoint than hard light fortress so you know you're, you're definitely improving grace um uh, so yeah it's a i thought it was a very cool stage to play through and you know once again, as I also believe I pointed out in the beginning, you know, the visuals were also quite nice in this one. So, yeah, you know, all around the solid stage on the harder side, you know. So, yeah, I will just leave it at that. Uh, thank you guys for watching and have a nice day.